Hi everyone, welcome back to my Pokemon Y walkthrough. Last episode, we beat uh, Katarina, the third gym leader. This very interesting gym battle. And then, uh, after that, she said we have to challenge her again as the Mega Evolution successor person at the Tower of Mastery. So we're going to be heading there today. And we're going to find out more secrets about this interesting evolution thing. Yep, here it is, the Tower of Mastery. You remember that uh, Jack Chan guy? Didn't let us go through. Oh, who's this? The Evolution Girl. Oh, Katerina. Kateri I mean the Evolution. I mean the Mega Evolution successor is waiting for you at the top of the tower. Alrighty then, that's where we're gonna be going. Hello, Shauna. Mm, I think you and Serena are going to compete against each other. And get really strong. I'm so glad we're all traveling together. <laughs> Being cheerful, I can see. And what is this? Are we gonna fight you? Come on. I'm gonna, I'm gonna reverse someone strong. Only those who have been approved. Only those who have been approved may climb the Tower of Mastery. Oh. You may pass. Well, that's boring. You didn't challenge us to anything. What is this? Anyways, there are actually some places we can go in. Like this one. This room here. Hello? So, do you know about. So, do you know the Mega Evolution Guru's real name? Is Gargan. Gar Garden. Uh, yeah, that's his name. And then this guy's gonna talk about like a Lucario and it's stone. Very interesting. He didn't even give, give us any uh, roller skating tricks. So, we're gonna gum up even more. Climb up this tower here. Check this room. And there's a Lucario. Lucario. Anyways, check out the Mega Evolution Guru. Check it. The Mega Evolution Guru is apparently a descendant of the first trainer to evolve Lucario into its Mega Evolution. And who could that possibly be? That's talking more about Mega Evolution. It's can you at least give me an item? What is this? I'm just climbing up even more and more and more. What's up here? Interesting. Maybe they'll give us an item. Since you were kind enough to come clear up here, I want to give you this. There we go. That's awesome. So, when you talk to this guy, he's going to give us TM37 Low Sweep. Very good. I just had a thought. Maybe the fact that people think up all these these ways to bring out the power of Pokemon is a message to us to look for all the possibilities everywhere. Very interesting. When he was younger, Professor Sycamore trained here to learn about Mega Evolu- When he was younger, Professor Sycamore trained here to learn about Mega Evolution. But he decided he didn't have what it takes to live fairly quickly and all that. She knows about Sycamore? That's very interesting. We're just climbing up even more in this tower here. This could be it. This could be it. Let's go in. Attic. I really love this place. When I'm here with my Pokemon, Looking at the wide open sky above, all my worries disappear, and I feel like I can do anything. Thanks for coming all the way up here. It was decided that this must be the place where the Mega Ring is handed over. Something about making sure we never forget to set our sights as high as the sky. And here it is, your very own Mega Ring. It's in the shape of a bracelet. So it's super easy to wear. Awesome. Katarina's just... She's one of my favorite gym leaders right now. Ooh, interesting. This bracelet. As we put in the Mega Ring on. Even though it's called a bracelet. That's very interesting to me. Should just give us a ring or something. Anyways. Give your Pokemon the right Mega Stone. And try battling with it. Your Pokemon will surely answer the call of the Mega Ring. 
Hint, hint, but make it a redactyl. Anyways. Hmm, Lucario, what's wrong? Gurf. Gurf. Oh, I guess he wants to battle with me. Why not? I'll give you a shot, Lucario. Lucario, are you sure? You want to battle alongside that trainer? Gurf. I don't know what to say. I'm a bit shocked that some traveling trainer seems to have a stronger bond with you than I do. Haha. <laughs> Well, he must be something special, so want to sit. So what'd you say, trainer? Will you and Lucario battle against me and my Lucario? A Lucario on Lucario battle. It will be nothing short of riveting. They both have a Lucario Knight in hand. How about we get the show on the road? No. I'm just kidding. Of course, yes. I can feel Lucario's passion. Perhaps it's just that it doesn't want to lose to the other Lucario. But it may be that it's just on the same wavelength as you. Ready, Lucario? Let's give it all we got. Let's give it all we got indeed. Let's do this. Ooh. Very, very awesome right now, man. It's amazing. Successor Katrina. Let's do this. And here's my Lucario. And it's level and it's ready level 32. So uh let's see. This little uh tutorial thing here. You press the mega evolution. And what should we do? Go with Mega Punch. Or power up punch. Why did I say mega punch? Or probably bone rush. But whatever. Let's just look at that, man. It's just amazing. Like I'm looking at it for the first time. Not really. I've seen some Wi Fi battles already online. My Lucario is faster. Very good, very good. Power up, attack, and she'll, she'll go for her own power up punch. But we survive. Because that's what we do, man. Go for another power up punch. That's it, man. We win. You defeated successor Katrina. What? What an incredible bond you have. What amazing power. Still looking all serious, I see. What an explosive battle. I can tell that both Mega Lucario didn't hold anything back. What, with strong bonds like that, you shouldn't have any trouble triggering your Pokemon's Mega Evolution. Grrrrf. I think it would be best if you took that Lucario along, along with you on your journey. I think it would be best if you took that Lucario along with you on your journey it's quite apparent that you two make a truly incredible team so what do you think should we get this Lucario? Gurf Gurf Lucario's staring intently at Enigma with you will you take Lucario with you? hmm should I take it? yes your party is full. Please choose a Pokemon to send to the PC box. Hmm. Get send in uh, Yoshi here. Cause I'm really starting to like uh, Amara more. Or Rainbow Draco. I don't remember the name. There we go. Sending uh, Lucario in the team. And we're gonna think of a nickname. Cause that's what we do, yo. What should we nickname it? Could nickname it Mega Mega Sonic. Oh whatever. Could name it Sonic. There we go. Where's the lower case? Sonic.
as long as Pokemon and trainers has the kindness to take care for each other and give and give each other courage, the world will be full of smiles. Grrrf. <laughs> Indeed, Katrina. As she stays up here forever. I wonder if she goes back to the gym. No, seriously, she just stays here. And we get to run around. Run around here. As we take her Lucario. Then we're gonna fly off this tower. And we're just gonna fly off the master tower. Why did I call it master tower? We're gonna off the Tower of Mastery, there we go. Where's my flying Pokemon? Wait, we cannot use fly yet. Find out how when we're gonna get fly as we leave the tower. Actually, I wanna know what she says. When an explosive battle, I could tell that both Mega Lucario didn't hold anything back. With strong bonds like that, you shouldn't have any trouble triggering your Pokemon's mega evolution. As long as Pokemon and trainers have the kindness to take care for each other and give each other courage, the world will be full. The world will be full of smiles. Oh, she just repeats again. That was fun. Let's go test some mega evolution right now. As we leave this tower right here, uh, that's not the exit, because there's a Pokemon I really want to test. And you'll find out eventually. Let's just run down. Boop, 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 boom. There we go. Other items related to Mega Evolution, like the Mega Ring or Mega Stones, must still remain hidden in the Fez Kalios region. Maybe I'll search. For them some more, so I can help strengthen the bonds between Pokemon and their trainers. Oh, he just talks about the research. There we go. Let's just get on the good old bicycle here and this red old back. Right back to the city. The city of lights. Not really. Uh. Where's my Aerodactyl? So now we can finally use Make Evolution. So we get to test some of that. Maybe use some battles. Sorry about that. And we're gonna meet someone. Uh, who's this gonna be? It's Shauna. Here, neighbor, you can use this. Oh, thank you so much, Shauna. Just thank you so much for surf. That's awesome. If you use the HM Surf, you can travel over the water. When I think about it, it's kind of amazing how a person like you come to Kalios and ended, and ended up traveling with me. It's like destiny in a way. It's That is so uh, cryptic. Come back here. What is that even supposed to mean? As you just run off, we're not really traveling together then. Or are we? Who knows? So, as we run all the way through here, talking to people, this random lady, Pokemon stand in them Pokeball. Pokemon stand in them Pokeballs, and other words, I don't know. Oh, it's a breeder. No, what the Skiddo and the Ranch are a surprisingly comfortable ride. That's very interesting. And, and I want to show you how to get Lapras also. So just randomly, uh, I think, uh, talk to, um, this guy here. This kind of Lapras here once saved me from drowning. I feel bad, though. I want to afford to travel around and show it the whole world, the whole wide world behind these parts. Hey, I've got an idea. You've got a Rumble badge. You must be a strong and seasoned trainer. I mean, traveler. Would you mind taking Lapras with you on your journey? Looks like your party is empty. Full is already full of fine bunch of Pokemon. If you want to take Lapras with you, free up a spot, then come back here. So that's exactly what we're gonna do. 
as we uh, roller skate here. But yeah, that's how you get Lapras, to just talk to that guy. Obviously, I'm not really going to use uh, Lapras because I already have a water Pokemon. But it's still very useful to have. So Lapras is awesome. Just uh, keep running. But I'll probably end it around here. I don't want to travel yet to the Skitter Ranch. This kind of lap, well, who really read that? So, yeah, it's uh. Sure! Awesome. I cannot think of a nickname at all. So, maybe, so maybe next episode I'll think of a nickname. Lapras, it's time for you to move on. Go out and swim to your heart's content. All around Kalios. Very sure of that then. And we're gonna test some make evolution. Finally. Oh Pajarichu. Or whatever that thing is. Uh, okay then. Gotta go for Aerial Ace. Man, that looks epic. <laughs> Go for ancient power here. Dang, those attacks are doing nothing. This Aerodactyl seems to be really bulky. As we go for some ancient power attacks. Take this thing down. It still survived. Very interesting. Come on, just one more bite. Oh, that's why it survived. It took the hit. What is that? There we go. Still, make it Aerodactyl just... That was amazing. Only if it wasn't paralyzed or anything. It would have probably done better. So now we're going to test Razor's Mega Evolution to Mega Venusaur. It's funny how I keep having uh, wild Pokemon that are super effective against me. Well, whatever. Sells nothing against me. Going to go for Mega Evolution here and some Razor Leaf. I was waiting so long for this Mega Venusaur. I may use it for a competitive team very soon. So yeah, probably around next week I'll do a tutorial on uh, what's it called? The super training. I didn't really do. I didn't do one yet. Probably why you can see there's no Pokemon using the super training thing yet. Dang, even ineffective and it still took the Pokemon out. Yep, some levels. So not a bad uh, episode. Just we battled uh, Katarina, the Mega Evolution successor. And we got Lapras. So yeah, next episode we'll be traveling to the Skiddo Ranch and... 
to our next adventures. So, thank you for watching. Please leave a like, a comment, and subscribe if you did not. And I'll see you guys next time. Thank you for watching, everyone.